When a bee stings, small parts of its stinger are left inside the skin. As with other foreign substances, it triggers the immune system. The macrophages are recruited to the site and are activated to disarm the perceived invader. This innate immune system activity leads to inflammation. If the initial response fails, the macrophages release signaling chemicals to invite more macrophages to enter the site and engulf the foreign substance in order to isolate it and prevent it from spreading further into the body. Some of the macrophages are elongated and turning into epithelioid cells with less defined cell borders and can form tight junctions, effectively walling the foreign substance inside. Some others combine together to form the multinucleated giant cells, whose nuclei are scattered inside or taking the shape of a horseshoe, called Langan's giant cells. Nearby cells can also signal other immune molecules to join, such as lymphocytes, eosinophils, and dendritic cells. The lymphocytes secrete substances that help the cells aggregate, further strengthening the barrier. If the fibroblast and collagen are present, then it indicates the cell aggregates have been formed for a while. This big lump of cells is called granuloma.